What is important to you? Give a writer a pen and she'll show you. Give a musician a guitar and he'll play it for you. But put the camera in the hands of a group of film students and we'll show you the world as it appears to us. This is us. This is our uni. And this is our city. We are the film students of today. Yes, come back! Mr. Percival's come back! We caught them and we shot them on the rule 303. Ah! The value of film in South Australia is well recognised as a means of expression for one's ideas, dreams and imagination. The film industry here has been prominent for over 30 years, supporting a variety of locally made work as well as international feature films. That's what prompted us to proclaim SA the film state. I think film is a, a really powerful medium because it kind of replaced the mind's eye. Film is global. It's in many ways almost the perfect art form. Film is important to almost all Western cultures. I think it's particularly important to South Australian um, because of its symbolic value. We nurtured and supported a whole lot of filmmakers who have then gone on to have fantastic careers, not just in Australia, but all around the world. The South Australian industry, for a number of years, almost was the Australian industry. Most of these films made in South Australia are done so in association with the South Australian Film Corporation. The Film Corporation was uh, created in the early 70s, and it was created really the first agency of its kind. Many good calibre of films came out of that period. What we do now is we primarily, we, we finance production, we develop scripts, we develop projects, we also um, support uh, production businesses to get up and going, we support um, uh, people to, to have attachments and um, to do travel to markets to try and raise finance for their films. We provide facilities here that are subsidised so it fits any budget of the films coming through. We have here at the present moment two sound stages. The sound at stage two has a cyclorama in it. It's a 12 metre by 12 metre cyclorama, which is utilised a lot for chroma key work, um, television commercials. We have five production offices, an art department, two wardrobes, uh, two makeup rooms, a Dolby digital mixing theatre. And um, so we've got everything you need to make a film here. The South Australian Film Corporation has been located at Hendon for many years now, but it's time for a change. A new headquarters will be constructed at Glenside. It's all part of the government's revamp of the Glenside campus. The underused mental health facilities are being improved and parts of it utilised for other purposes, including a unique film and screen hub to bring many of the state's film companies together at one site. The relocation has been talked about probably about the last maybe 15, maybe 20 years. So. Numbers of CEOs have probably lived the same nightmare that I've lived, trying to make it happen. I think that um, ultimately it's it's about providing a new home uh, in terms of the actual studios and sound stages and production facilities that you ha we have. It's going to be diverse at what we can bring in there. Just as importantly is the sense that we'll be creating a something of a hub connected to those facilities. So it's one thing to build the bricks and mortars of a facility, but it's another thing to actually develop an industry. The construction of the Adelaide Film and Screen Hub plays a crucial part in the future of film in South Australia, but there are also many other organisations that support film production within the state. The Media Resource Centre really is about creating opportunity for all independent pr um, practitioners and also it extends those opportunities to communities. It gives people who are aspiring to tell stories on um, screen um, their first opportunities. People need to be able to have a track record. You really need to be able to show um, the industry what you're able to do. And the Media Resource Centre for many people gives them the beginnings of their track record. We screen 200 short films a year. We assist with 50 short films being made by local um, filmmakers and we launch all of them in a kind of professional environment in the Mercury Cinema, which really makes it a special event. The Adelaide Film Festival is held every two years. We're a biennial festival and we're held in the off year to the Adelaide Festival of Arts and build on the tradition, the wonderful tradition of festivals in South Australia. Film, while it's an incredibly accessible and popular medium, uh, still means that because it's run by mainly in terms of exhibition and distribution, it's mainly run by commercial outfits, we don't get to see 90% of what's 
created around the world. So a film festival, by curating a program, brings a whole lot of films that an Adelaide audience, and certainly budding filmmakers, would never, ever get to see. So with all of these opportunities popping up all over the state, what is the one key factor that will define the future of our film industry? The film students, of course. I think we do have a strong film industry here, especially in South Australia. I think it's probably more strong than any other state. You sort of have to make your own opportunities. You don't necessarily need to go to the other states or overseas even. This is the time um, to get involved. I think I'll probably be looking for work here. I want to stay in Adelaide, yeah. I see really exciting opportunities for the South Australian film industry. Great things. I think you just got to give it a go. Get together with your friends. Shoot something over a weekend. It doesn't have to be something that is perfect. The passionate and the hard-working ones always survive through the industry. It's a hard road, but it's ultimately a very rewarding road. I'm scared, it's only you. We fear the end of it, the ball the real. Oh, Film has provided and continues to provide people with a voice the means of expression for one's ideas, dreams and imagination. You've heard what we have to say, so I guess there's really only one more thing left to add.